Hi everybody. So what I have here is a Sony PlayStation Portable Model 1001, aka the PSP. And as you can see here, while this is in used condition, the shell doesn't seem to be in bad condition, although there are some minor scratches. And so for this video, I am going to be modifying this Sony PlayStation Portable so that I can replace the existing LCD in this thing with the more modern IPS LCD. Because while this screen isn't too bad for the PSP 1000, the viewing angles aren't really the greatest because this is rather an older kind of LCD and the IPS LCDs seem to have much better viewing quality and it can be shown in any angle. So let's get right into it. Okay, so I took the PSP 1000 apart partially, which I unscrewed all the screws in the back and I removed the front faceplate and now the old LCD is detached from here and I will be replacing this LCD with the newer IPS LCD in there. All right, so um, before I install this new IPS LCD into this PSP 1000, I used a soldering iron to solder a wire right here between these two points so that it can be useful for when the new IPS LCD comes in. Despite the fact that it was kind of tricky for me to solder these wires, solder, solder this short this connection with a wire using a soldering iron being a little tricky um i got the hang of it and it took time and patience to get it right so now i'm going to be testing out this new ips lcd in this psp here all right so i got this ips lcd connected into the psp motherboard and this works like a charm so i'm going to just reassem uh, reassemble this psp and i'll show you what it looks like in the end Voila! This PSP 1000 screen is now replaced with a newer and better IPS LCD in there. Now this IPS LCD, which is newer than the original stock Sony PSP 1000 LCD, has better viewing angles, as you can see. So I am going to be doing a comparison with this new IPS LCD and the original screen side by side so you can see the difference between the two. So after you saw the difference between this new IPS LCD and the original OEM Sony PSP 1000 display, this IPS LCD certainly does get much brighter compared to the original LCD. And like I said, this LCD is able to be shown in all angles. Well, this wraps up for this video. If you like this video, why don't you hit that like button and subscribe to this channel. Have a nice day.